five. Yeah, it must have been eight. So I don't remember getting when I was or nine or I don't remember. It was. I adore all the. Oh, Gen two designs are great. I still think Typhlosion gets the short end of the stick half the time. Entei is probably my favorite Pokemon ever made. He's literally just the god of volcanoes. He looks mid. Boy, if I had a hand that could reach for this microphone, I would strangle you right now. I have a gun. It's Texas. Everyone owns a gun. I know. And I'll shoot your hand. That is my crazy fucking mother-in-law. So, yeah. Damn, that hard, huh? So I have a question. What do you think of V from DMC5? What do you think of V? Because I know when that game came out, people were simping hard as fuck for V when he when DMC5 came out. Ah, uh, the emo goth boy doesn't give any good vibes to you. Uh, remember a bunch of people were like simping for the man when uh, the game first came out yeah cause I remember there was a lot of people simping for V when the game came out like it was insane like the soul like the the I'll be gentle quote was oh my god it was absolutely insane how many people were simping for that man I'm happy I caught something you got meat. I wonder if someone dropped How do you this. exactly catch it looks meat? very stylish. A dumpling rod. What Wait, the fuck? I mean, that's just a hunting ground. Yeah. I'm gonna take a bath. Hunting ground. Time for a relaxing bath. Ah, the gay I guy. Fuck, you didn't bathe. Oh, so I'm sharing the game. Also, I met the gay guy. I know, I see it. I say you come here to get back peak condition as well. I'd like a bath to warm the body and soul. Whew. Water is very pleasant today. It's perfect, even. Wait, what the fuck is he wearing? Wait. Uh, very traditional Japanese undergarments for the medieval period. I'm gonna let y'all fans delve on, let you guys delve on this. I'm gonna pay for pizza. Uh, look, come on. The captain says everything's going well. We should reach the port tomorrow. I see. Thanks, Alicia. Hey, does the sky look darker to you? Yikes. Boat's starting to rock more than normal. Alicia, stop rocking the boat! It looks like a storm is brewing. So get below decks before the rain picks up. So we can wait to rain, I think, tomorrow or something. I don't know. Whoa! Man, man. Jeez, what was that? The boat just led to a halt! Did you run into something? I Alicia, I told you to stop rocking the boat. You can shut the fuck up. You be yeah. Song, I feel like getting out of the copyright strike on this account. You be yeah. Chat's been quiet. Bitchy bitchy bitch. There's a museum in New York that's about an hour 15 away from me. And we had, they have like a lot of like samurai armor, a lot of medieval armor on display. It's really cool. They also had like a hieroglyphics exhibit when I was there. The most boring part of the exhibit was the American art. The American art. We make really boring art in this country, and I'm not ashamed to admit it. Like, we make better works of like literature and movies and shit than we do actual art. I'm talking about like fine artwork, I'm not talking about like cool art. Oh yeah, I know it's the cab armor. You gotta... I feel like that would also be dangerous, too, considering... You probably have, like, metal shrapnel going into you if you got hit by the direct attack. Yeah, but I like seeing, like, all the like, old art they had from, like, ancient African tribes and all this stuff that they had. It was really cool. It was, uh... It's the Metropolitan in New York. Really cool. Expensive as hell to go in there, but really cool. Great. 
I got just I just got stabbed in the ass. I what? Uh, I was. You know how I said I had an ear infection earlier? Dude. They never really like clear. I feel like you're just stuck in the You know how I said I got an ear infection earlier? Yeah. Uh, I had my mom find some medicine that usually it's like the one you have to use a needle for. And I'm like, okay, cool, whatever it takes to get rid of it. And I completely forgot you have to stab yourself in the ass with it. Stab yourself in the ass? What? Oh, uh, with the medicine. To hopefully hey, get rid what? of it. It's like a medicine hang on, hang on, you need. It's an injection you need to. Uh... Not an EpiPen. It's for my ear for an ear infection. Uh, dude. Uh, in my many years of living on this planet and being the son of a nurse, I've never heard of medicine that goes in your ass for a. No, uh, it's not an EpiPen. It's like an injection through one of your cheeks. Oh, she gave you injectable. She gave you Benadryl for the sound of it. Yeah, there's a, is, the question is, your medical breath, does it help with the ear infections? If it's caused by allergies. But does it help with ear infections? I wouldn't know. I'll ask my mom about that, because that's my curious question. We'll text her and ask her, and then we'll figure it out later. Poor Corin, I can't breathe me for you back in the castle. No, we did the Norian Circle Church together, you remember? I will show no mercy! I can't get over that Norian Circle Jerk joke. I'm the greatest joke I've ever made. It really is. You just said it out of nowhere. Yeah, that's how I get no, you. you know mercy! First off, that was unconsensual on my part, and two... Not gonna lie, you kinda suck with that. Voice you ever heard. Huh? That's you, that's Felicia. I know, hold on. Flo, what are you doing? Stop this right now. Did you come here to kill us? To kill your own sister. Don't tell me you're the one responsible for freezing the ocean. Essentially, the, he's the king is forcing her tribe to kill Corin. Okay, so he's got insane. I'm gonna kill 25% of my population if you don't do this thing. Pretty much all Genius. five people. <laughs> all, all five, five people, people because most of them have starved to death. People probably live in North. Oh, you're not wrong. They probably just all starved to death or some shit. That's fucked up, actually. <laughs> probably. How am I allowed to threaten our village? Forcing siblings to fight as well. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Felicia. I can't listen to anything you say. I love you. I love you. That's what they are. For the good of the ice tribe, I must chip my heart and do what is command. Don't do this. That's no use, Felicia. We have to fight back against them or we're done for. I love you too much to let you get all my like this. Oh, oh. Now allow me to spill that's on the pretty shit. Now all I can do for you now is end your life with my own hand. By the way, for your cut, you were going to be strangled to death for your own cut. Your own cut. I have to know the question. I need to know the answer. Christ almighty. Camila, what is wrong with you? It's very story heavy. But is it, is it a good like, story, I though? Like, I know if the book combat would have been a lot better. Is it a good oh, story, it's though? Oh, no, it's a good story. Okay, cool. That's all that matters to me. Baruka. I on the part where this one farmer oh. Literally by the burns way, his own to get you off of his land. By the way, I this think I think the version of Fire Emblem we are playing is the fan translation. I think. 
if because essentially in the original English version, they had Baruka and Kaze or Baruka and Saizo just not talk to each other, like literally yeah, when right. you. Apparently, as a really stupid thing, a stupid attempt at comedy, you try to get her and Kaz Saizo to talk to each other, and it's just silence. Yeah, how the hell Yeah, it's stupid, because in the original game they had dialogue. Wait, wait, we're playing. We're not playing the game. When you have Saizo talk with a uh, Baruka, they just don't talk oh, to each other. Me. This is in the original game, though. So apparently the... So I think we're playing the tr fan translation. We'll figure it out later. I, I just said... It. Yeah, I just said what I think. I'm not saying we are. Play Conquest? He's fucking... He somehow comes with you to ignore. I don't know how. They have a lot of dudes. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Oh, dead man. Look at that. Oh, you know what you could have done? You could have put her in the corner and they both could have attacked him. It's not like it matters, though. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's pretty dead. Dude, her attack's that fucking nuts. Yeah, because she is literally fucking insane. She also has life steal. What reason is there for that? Wait. Attack the no no can't attack the archer. Bro, he has half health. Don't do that. With no healing items. Fuck. I'm in the back seat, you but this level is gonna pain in here. I wonder, can Takumi attack from here? Yes he can. Uh Takumi oh, uh, Takumi, would you uh, would you mind putting this man's head against that that boat? Also, no matter how many kills you get, you're still sleeping in the blacksmith stable. There we go. Oh, it always happens. Dude, the difficulty spike in this game is a nightmare. Yeah, like, when you just... Burp, right? Like, when you get a difficulty spike in this game, it is a difficulty spike. There is no denying it. The one in Birthright sucks because it's this Aqua House level, or this, uh, Opera House level, and you're not even meant to kill anybody, you're meant to get the fuck out of there. And people will die. <laughs> the thing is, though, it's like everyone's so... One of the so... worst levels they've ever made in Fire Emblem. And I hate it's it. just the fact that they're so aggressive is the problem. Oh, hey, Devin D. Hey, Devin O. I used Mary Vic and I'm replacing with... Yell Mori. That is bad. Oh, this is killing. Look at that. Bye-bye. Ha-ha! <laughs> Bye bye. They don't work. They don't work. Uh, see if there's like some kind of mod loader you can get. I'm sure there's a uh, mod loader for your totally legit 3DS. Well, I, well, tell me what it is, cause I could try. Cause I can't find one. I don't know. You could, unless the mod's meant to work for the jailbroken 3DS and not a uh, legit one like we have. Maybe. Who knows? That's what I'm thinking. It could be made to work with one that's like jailbroken and not like an emulator. Maybe. I mean, for the legit 3DS. Whoa! Murder! I know about the ND. Let me in, let me in. Uh, that's if we ever do it, JK. I'm still, uh... I have a... DM handbook, if anything. If I do do D and D for these guys, I might do Curse of Fraud. That's like one of the easiest ones to run. Maybe. I just don't have a Curse of Fraud. So I want to do. I want to run a Pokemon. What's that other one? It's like 3.5 D and D. I want to run a Pokemon Pathfinder mod. But Shinigami's not then in the Pokemon, nor is our other friend. It sucks. Would you play a Pokemon Pathfinder game with tabletop? I would. I just don't know how would they you? work. I mean, I could teach you. It's basically, just Pokemon. Shocking, isn't it?
right on. Getting them heat. Hell yeah. Oh, we have to go there to make a thing. What it do, motherfucker? Ah. Where, where the fuck did all these warships come from? Probably Camila's. Camila's fucking. Lee what are they? Him. Yeah. Yeah, flee her fleet. And there's gonna be another dead man. Yep. I like how she laughs every time she murders someone. Like, it's like the funniest shit to her, apparently, where she just wants to murderize everyone she meets. Wants to kill everyone. Yeah. Oh yeah, you're right, the katanas look like meat cleavers. Why do they look like meat cleavers? Why? The only katana that looks like a katana is the one that uh, Realm has. It's so weird. Yeah. Some people put butter on Pop Tarts, and those people are crazy. Why is the cool katana this strong? What about strong in the Damiato? I can't afford to show you mercy! It drives me through to hold nothing back! Are you prepared to die? I'll freeze you all! Well, we just committed a genocide. Won. You've won, Corrin. Even though you didn't even fight me one bit. Now kill me. Uh, uh you alright, shooting on me? Oh I god! Oh, <laughs> I forgot I was muted. No! Oh god, You're hitting dialogue, but nothing's happening. Oh, uh, why do I forget? You admit defeat too early. Oh, well, that's why it ended so fast then. Dude. Yes. Oh. Do Baruka. Oh, I'm Baruka. All right. You admit defeat too early. We can retreat and try again. <gasps> no. No. You know as well as I do that death awaits those who fail my father. We'll be executed if we return home. I'd rather die at Corin's hands to have the to have the last thing I see be his face. Please, Corin. Camila, you sure about this? You're willing to surrender your life to me? You've left me no I am. Go on, my dear brother. I won't beg for mercy. Understood. All right. In that case, Camila, you're coming with us. Huh? All right, he just chops her head off in front of all of her troops. <sighs> you can't be serious. You out of your mind, Corn? They just tried to kill you. Why would you invite him to join? Talk to me. Talk to me. First off, shut the fuck up. I know how you feel about Norm, but you can't believe I would kill my own sister. Even though she fought against us, it was only because King Garen demanded it. Now she's safe from him. Remember, our real enemy isn't a part of Hoshido or Nor. Mm -hmm. A real enemy? Here's the thing, it's not going to be an incest waifu, and rather, we're shipping this little bastard, shipping this little bastard with Camila. Their incest waifu. <laughs> Shut up, JK. You, the hero, put an end to this fighting! Hero? I'm going to go jack off and think about this rigorously! 
Yes, a moment ago, I saw your sword glow. Whoa. I'm sure it must be the sword spoken of in old legends from my tribe. I'm having fun with this voice, can you tell? You heard something about this weapon. Apparently they use it as a dildo substitute. So that's why it's wet. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> yes, I was hoping you'd say something like that. <laughs> a shining, cum-glistening sword! The one who uses it is supposed to save the world! God damn it. Which would, which would make you the hero, wouldn't it, Lord Corrin? I don't know. This thing has seen a lot of work. I think my siblings must have been using it. Takumi, were you using it? Uh, I might have shoved it up my ass once. I mean, uh... I, we just established a corn sword as part dildo. It's one dangerous one, too. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. How are we not canceled yet? I don't fucking know. We don't have a Twitter. We... If, as, I don't know either. We don't. We don't have a Twitter. As long as we don't have Twitter, we're uncancelable. <laughs> fucking dying over here laughing. I believe in you, Corn. And whatever, and whatever it is you set out to do, I like how Camilla actually has. Camilla's better written than a lot of the uh, family of Nor. She actually like has loyalty and realizes the gravity of the situation. That, and she has actual character development with her lore where it's like Wait, you know when it comes to the dad she was just following orders if yeah anyone, because anyone coming in and end this war will be you yeah because it's her family and she cares a lot about her i mean this is pretty cool too camilla the dudes are kind of shit though <laughs> i can't imagine that the others will trust me yet though do you know if it, if it's how she's in tradition to listen to anyone's conversation of Sessions of others. Well, um, but apparently it is Hoshin in tradition to uh, put dead remains of love on your food. Uh, sorry, I was just... Huh. My apologies. Sorry, we didn't mean to pry. Well, Sakura. It's roasted all of them at once. Even you, Azura? Huh? Hold on. You're a Zora. Same as Zora that was kidnapped. You remember me? Yes. Of course I do. I saw you many times in the castle. I think out of everyone, Camilla might be the oldest. She looks like she's about 30. No, she's like early 20s. She just hit puberty earlier than everyone else. And if I remember correctly, the Norian nobility used to treat you horribly. You did not hear what I just said, did you? I heard what you said. <laughs> Hinoka is 22, and considering the fact each sibling from both families are around the same age, it should make sense that Hinoka is 22. Huh? They did. Why? Azora's mother, Queen Arette, Queen Arette, Queen Arette was father's second wife. However, there were many in the nobility who supported Queen Katrina. Okay. My mother was one such person. She constantly told me to talk to Azura, or not to talk to Azura. So technically we're the King of Nor's kid? No. Because remember, we were stolen. Oh, yeah. Of course, Xander, being Queen Katrina's child, was, was told the same thing. Later, when Leah was born, he was also kept away from her. We were dutiful children, so we obeyed. We always wish we could spend time with you, like real siblings. All the no <laughs> all the Nordian siblings have different moms. Oh god, that means this dude had four wives. Five of them, actually. We never forgot about you. You're our adorable sister, after all. Thank you for saying that, Why Camilla. do you like Camilla so much? I don't know why. She's actually pretty cool. 
Yeah, because she actually has a well written character. That's the thing with Fates. Is that yes, we shit on it most of the time, but there are nuggets of genius in there. The problem is that entire game is not that genius. We're giving her to Kumi. Hey, with me. Um How about we throw her off the ship and say we did? <sighs> Zura, you shouldn't trust her so easily. Though your siblings, you can't be certain of her motives. Oh my. Oh, Takumi. True. Hang on one second. Shut the fuck up, Takumi. There we go. I just said that in the megaphone so everyone can hear it on the ship. Then everyone knows that he's a whiny BB bitch. No, he's right. You have every reason to be weary of me. She's just putting away a dagger that's labeled kill everyone later. <laughs> Uh, what's that dagger for? Oh, this, uh... Just throws it in the ocean. <laughs> Never mind that. We were just fighting a moment ago, after all. But you don't need to worry. I'll make your deaths painless. From this point forward, I will do nothing that would upset Corin. Though, if Corin asks, I won't... Uh, I wouldn't object to taking one or two of you out. Oh. Jesus, Camilla! And some of that character writing just went out the window. Great. By the way, did you ever hear of a Norian circle jerk? Ah, <laughs> uh, one of my best jokes. Dude, I can't take it. That joke was our biggest mistake and funniest thing we ever. No, it was. It was my biggest mistake. <laughs> every Norian character is gonna bring up the Norian circle jerk to the host units. Camila. Camila. Me. JK, shut up. <laughs> I'm a, I'm only kidding. No more dark humor for now. I'll keep things light. Takes out another dagger that's labeled kill. Kill Hinoka. Throws it in the water. Oh. Time for a relaxing bath. Hey, Kaze. How you doing, brother? Hey, Korn, did you ever... A good soak can be very soothing. By the way, oh, Corn, did you ever notice that dude. weird mole? Kaze's me, remember? Oh, I know. I was just trying to make a joke. Good soak can be very soothing. Take all the time I need here. JK. Aw, oh, it's just Kaze. <laughs> Damn it, it's just Kaze. I wanted to see covered up tits. I'm like a bath to warm the body and soul. Wait, is this game me 10 T. Really? Yeah, once Awakening hit, they started to make their games rated T for Fire Emblem. I feel like it's quite tame for a teen game. It's a soft T. Oh, you know why? They mentioned killing people, that's why. Yeah, fantasy reason, violence. When that's mentioned, you have to rate it T. Yeah. Oh, wait, no, that's a lie, because Shadow the Hedgehog mentioned killing people more, and that shit was E10. At least here it was. I'm like a bath to warm the body and soul. Water's warm brains yeah, does most get... of these pains of the day. If I get 50 subs by the end of the year on my end, I swear to God I'll play Shadow of the Hedgehog on my channel. Every ending. I swear. Oh, boy. I'm gonna be E10, Camila. <laughs> oh, no. Dude, I love that game. That's not no, a problem not, for me. Not you. Look at JK. Look what he just said. Oh, the Shadow of the Hedgehog? Yeah, I have plenty of copies. I have the GameCube copy. I have an emulated copy. Plenty of copies. I think I've been here long enough. I'm an E10 Camila. Oh no. Wait, really to Shadow the Hedgehog or really to E10 Camila? No, JK. Oh, he said really to him? No, he said I'm gonna be I'm gonna be E10 for Camila because he's simply for Camila right now. Hey. E10 for Camila. Huh? These days. Dude, I fucking love Shadow the Hedgehog. A lot of people are like, it's the worst game ever. Sonic 06 called and wants its money back. Oh 100%. It is worse than Shadow of Six is way worse like, than Shadow the Hedgehog. Say what you want about Shadow of the Hedgehog. At least it's a playable game, unlike fucking Sonic 06. Oh boy, let's play Project 06. Like, Project 06 is genuinely at good. Tried something. At least they tried to make a uh, platform shooter. I was one of those kids back in the day that fell for the edgy marketing, and now I have a love for that game. I just have a soft spot for that sort of stuff. When like someone says the game is edgy, I'm like, oh, you mean it's a masterpiece? Okay. <laughs> oh, you mean it's fucking amazing? Uh, yeah. Yeah, it's why I love Stranger of Paradise. It's amazing. 
Dude, the intro for Shadow of the Hedgehog is stuck in my First brain. of all, first of all, the pretty the Secret Ring soundtrack is amazing. I have not played Secret Rings, but I heard it's kind of mech cuz it was on the Oh game. yeah, it's a mech game. Don't get me wrong, it's a mech game. No, but I heard the soundtrack for that one's really good. Was that the medieval one? Medieval and the one in that that's yourself the Seven Arabian, Arabian Nights, but yeah. Sonic's starting to make a comeback with its games. I do want to play the new Sonic Adventure game that's coming out with Shadow and everyone. Sonic X Shadow Generations, not Adventure. Wasn't it actually an adventure title though, technically? No, because the original game was just, oh, here's a hub world, but not white, not quite. You're just going left to right to the next level. Wait, it's a port of an old game? Yeah, Shadow, Sonic X Shadow Generations is a port. It's an enhanced port. Yeah, what console was it on? I never PS3, I don't remember this PS3 at all. 360. Dude, my favorite Shadow game or Sonic game from that generation has to hands down be Sonic Unleashed. Dude, here's, here's, the thing. here's 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 the thing. That is not a controversial opinion because a lot of people love Unleashed. Dude, the Sonic levels where you're running are fantastic. It was just the Werehog levels that were. Yeah, doing. which is the common opinion. You make, dude, you make it sound like your opinion is blasphemous when everyone has that opinion, dude. Dude, whenever I mention I like Sonic Unleashed, people try and rip me a new one. People are like, why do you like the bad Sonic games? Because I played the bad Sonic games growing up. Yeah, I got a problem with it. Most of my games I bought were from the oh, GameStop. Oh, oh, now I get it. You're dealing with the diehards. Yep, that explains it. You're the, you're dealing with the adventure diehards. That explains a thing. lot. Most of the games I had in 360 were all from the uh, were all from the GameStop used bin. So I got bought games from there at 20 bucks, or I went without. Yeah, that explains a lot because a lot of the time it's the, um, the it's the adventure crowd that shits on new games. Oh, yeah, I love the Unleashed story. I like how Eggman just fucking broke the world into pieces and shit. Yeah, awesome. it's a good story. Are those? Oh, More... that was Ellipsis, not an explanation point. More family? Oh! Beastmen. <laughs> I forgot about them. Y'all should run. Run away. It's Dude, not I wish safe they were here. Beast Race. They were pretty cool. Get, get away while you can't. What? They have tails? Poor thing. Akira, you're a healer. Do your fucking job. These poor creatures, they've been horribly injured. Princess Sakura, could you tend to them? I just told her to do that, Kimola. Uh, yeah. I'll heal them right away. Hey, guys. Uh, what do you do if they have a broken spleen? Just heal it. It'll be fine. If I ever make like, a away. universe, I feel like a whole new person. Thanks, friend. Me too. It's wonderful. Thank you very much, kind lady. Be sure to repay you someday. No. Please don't worry. It was nothing. I'm glad. Oh, wait, I seem to be I'm missing one glad. left testicle. I guess they neutered me. I'm glad right, you're both feeling better. Hey. How did the two of you get hurt anyway? This town is in ruins. Were you part of the battle? Oh, am I them? Uh, no. We were here to visit. We only arrived a little while ago. Things have been strange the whole time we've been here. No reason at all areas of the town have just been Wait, falling apart. Wait, where are we? Hoshio or Nor right now? Uh, I think we're in... Ho Nor. Oh, what? then I'm them, then. What you see now wasn't the result of any fighting at all. What's that? But that's impossible. Uh, it's the truth. It's... Building the plaza started crumble for no reason. Tried our best to reinforce things, but as soon as we started to help, we were attacked by- Two tears of joy count. We were attacked by some sort of invisible forces. Invisible forces? And if that's the case, then that would mean- yeah. Everyone listen up. We had to get moving. Ryoma and Prince Xander are fine on the outskirts of town. What was that? What? Ryoma and that's Xander are here. That's story on, my, on their end. Let's go. We have to stop them. Hey. Hey, wait. Who are you allied with anyway? Hey. Nor Hoshido. Nor Hoshido. Look at you all, I'd say both, but that doesn't seem very likely. Well No, that's right. We're from both kingdoms, but we aren't with either one. We're people trying to end this war. What? Now on the other side, then can we join you? Huh? You sure? Our mission isn't as easy as is an easy one. In fact it's gonna be dangerous. Yep. Ah, that's fine. 
No, we don't we want to travel with our packs. Well, you're going to end this war, then I feel like we should help. All right, Caden? That's actually why a lot of men went to war back then, because they kind of had nothing better to do. Yep, of course we should. we got to repay these kind of people somehow. Plus, this town is a great place. People are welcome, are really welcoming to us shapeshifters. I'd happily fight for its safety. Thank you. I can't they don't question that they're shapeshifters. I oh. love the, I love, I love the idea that they're just both wagging their tails as I say this. Oh, we haven't even introduced ourselves yet. My name's Corin. I'm Kaden. As you can see, I'm from the most beautiful race in the world, Kitsune. I could transform into a giant fox if I use a beast stone. I'm Keaton, and I'm superior. And I'm Keaton, Lord leader of the race known as the Wolf Skin. Transform into a wolf when I use a beast stone. Huh, a fox and a wolf. Sounds like you'll be great help to us. I say we try them out. All right, everyone, follow me. Hey, let's What's going on? Then we're blaming each other for this carnage. Oh. Of course, kingdoms at war will always twist things to benefit themselves. But in this case, you can see both of them are right. Huh? What do you mean? Yeah, but I like to imagine you're just yelling at each other on the battlefield, like, "Hey, you're a dick. So are you." <laughs> Fuck you, you too, 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 Ben! Ben is <laughs> <laughs> yelling at each other off the sides of the battlefield. Why don't we just get closer? I don't know! You can go fuck yourself! <laughs> hey, did you. Hey, Korn, did you tell Takumi to go fuck himself yet? No, Ryum, I'll get on that! <laughs> hey, Takumi! Takumi's like right next to him. I'm right next to you. Ryoma said to go fuck yourself! <laughs> That's him with a microphone in his hand. <laughs> if any of you know how to make animatics, you know what to do. Kane and Keaton told us all we need to know. So can't see starting to fall apart on its own. Usually no one would even begin to believe this sort of fairy tale. But we have first, but we have first experience with an invisible force bound on destruction. Are you talking about the invisible soldiers from... Truly. Yes, but neither side knows to look for their real enemy. It's only natural that they blame one another in this situation. However, I can't Wait. See oh, so the invisible soldiers attacked and they think one another attacked the town. Yeah. You can see them too, can't you, Corin? I. Hmm. <laughs> you Hoshiden. Stop for such cowardly tactics! Oh, Are you such cowardly Silence! Tactics? Why don't you just admit that this is all you're doing? No. By the way, is that coffee yours contagious? No. Is that sneeze of yours contagious? All the Hoshidans just had their injections for it, and the Norians didn't. The Norians had injections for the Hoshidan fever, and the Hoshidans had the injections for the Norian cough. Go to either side and get each other's disease when it spreads like rapid fire for their kingdoms. <laughs> yeah. You're both wrong. What the fuck? Hold on. For those who don't know in chat... I couldn't think of a book. I thought it'd be fucking hilarious if I had Xander randomly talk like a child between his sentences. So I made up a thick condition he has called the Norian Cough. Wasn't the Norians or Hoshidans destroy this town? There are invisible enemies to blame. Can you see that they're tricking you? Invisible enemies can't be serious, Corey. I'm dead serious. I know the truth. The real enemy is nearby. There, look near the plaza. You can make out a watery sort of shadow. They're the ones who destroyed this town. They're the real enemy. What? What? <coughs> I don't see! Yeah. Look harder, Xander. We have to fight them off if we want to save this town. It's the only way for us to bring peace to the world. Maybe my brothers, but I won't go easy on you if you try to stop me. Come, everyone. Thank you, Kyle. Who's retainer was Rain is? Was she one of the ocean guys? Yeah. Or oh, she's not a retainer. She, I think she's just a general or some shit. You have so many retainers, I forget who belongs to who. Yeah, but some of them are just like people that just join us for no reason. Don't worry, we're good. Oh, uh, wait, I'm thinking of uh, Fire Emblem. Once he makes Archer boss in. Hang on, Ninja, while I throw this ridiculous thing at you. Oh. Lining up with like Daiso. Oh. 
big titty goth incest. Oh god. Oh. oh. What do you mean, where is your braze, jackass? What about jackass? Uh, the wolf band said, where is my praise? You a bad boy. No. Oh, I didn't hear him. So, like, the scream was glitching for a second. You a bad boy. You a bad. bad, bad be. You a bad boy. You play brass, buggy Taga, bitch. You a bad, bad boy. You a bad boy. You a bad boy. Bad, bad boy. Oh, yes, you got them duty weapons. Bad boy. Uh, what is one guy? I remember how I did it now. Um, what we did is that we essentially just. Can we use the uh, we, block method? We had Camila, Peruka, and Reyna carry everyone over to the other side and basically bypass all of this. Smart Why is she didn't just red? Sm that's not a Hoshiden. Oh, that is a Hoshiden. Never mind. No. Why is he like pure red? I don't think. It's in rage mode? I don't know. You idiot, you're not doing any oh, damage. Okay. I'm just like, oh, please. She's in a really good spot for dodging. Also, I noticed this one doesn't have terrain effects. Or it does, it's just not a lot of them. Oh, douche! Dead dragon. I like that bridge riddle, you're just getting everyone over. If this, if the wolf goes over, he'll eat the sheep. If the sheep goes over, he'll eat the cat. If you got it. That's the only class in this call. You assume she is one. Okay, I'll take your word for it. Over there. Yeah. Why Gunter, you ass? So try Stay away from Gunter. Oh, look at that. Crit. Ooh. Wow, right through him. War and I go way back. I stub my toe in now. Corin, would you kindly just um, murderize this man for me, please? It old murder. Yeah. Hell yeah. Ding. And for Babby Bab. Let's go. Oh, he broke his armor. Nice going, Gunter. Yeah. Oh, well. Oh. We got a hand axe, which is completely useless. Let's go. This isn't over. We'll fight to the <laughs> there is man. You won't see Hoshido waver. We'll fight so there's no one left. We're just gonna get all our soldiers this is killed. Bad. And yeah, will they really want to be defeated? Those two are still at each other's throats. Big brother. Ryoma, Ryoma, Xander, please, you both have to listen to me. We defeated the real enemy, and you don't need to fight each other now. <laughs> Whoever <coughs> retreats admits defeat. Nor will never lose to Hoshido. Yes. This war continues till we take our last breath. No. You can't be serious. Xander, Ryoma! Uh, 
that song. Listen to speak. What? Is this? Oh, it's you. Is this some? <laughs> Can't be. Azura? Azura? He's trying to get, what are he's you? trying to get literally sent by and never me. Ugh. What is this feeling? I feel so relaxed. It's like I've lost the will to fight. Wait, she could do that shit the entire time in both chapters. And she didn't stop any of it at any time. Well, I mean, things were too hectic at that point, and things were like emotions were high, and we didn't have the units we didn't have now. Wait, what's uh, banging? Oh, that's me just messing with my mic stand. Azra, you alright? You have my support. I'm fine. You don't need to worry. My songs have special power. It's just. It's really exhausting to use one of them. You stop them with that power? Truly. Yes, I want to avoid helping to do that, but it just. Why do I have a helped. good feeling she's gonna be dead at the end of this route? Nah. Ryoma, Xander. It wasn't Nori who should have destroyed this town. It was done by the invisible forces that we just defeated. Now uh, that they're gone, I will not allow any more senseless violence. I will sing my song as many times as necessary to restore peace. Do you still insist on fighting? This calm feeling. Barely with my sword. I have to clear my head. Big brother! Xander, my brother! Come to the suspension bridge at the bottomless canyon. Come on the days that the skies are change above Hope Shadow and Nor. That really isn't a compelling reason to walk into what could be a Hoshidan trap. I'm so sorry. Sorry, I wish I could say more, really, but you'll understand when you get there. If you come there, I'll be able to tell you the truth. I want us to fight on the same side. Save the world. Hmm. <laughs> you abandoned family that raised you, Corrin! I have no reason to trust you. Xander, wait, if he joins me, <sighs> at least ask her a question for me. God, the cops getting worse. Speak quickly. You're trying my patience. Yeah. We met, we met with Archduke Gizana. He said go meet the dragon. You have any idea what he meant by that? Why would I tell a traitor like you anything of value? Big brother. Xander. It'll be fine, Corin. We really should get him some honey for that cough, though. I'm sure he'll come. Let's believe in him, too, okay? If he joins our army, I'll probably cure his cough. Okay. Camilla. Hope you're right. Can't even lift my sword. Common problem for men his age, Chet. Corn, Azura, you just filled me in on what you've done so far. You're really trying to stop this senseless fighting and save both Hoshido and Nor? Yeah. Yes, yeah, so though, I cannot tell you any more about my motivations right now. <laughs> you really are asking for my trust, aren't you? Can't explain why, but you want me to follow? I'm so sorry. No, it's a lot to ask, Ryoma. <laughs> <laughs> What a Ooh, fun boy! He's fucking hot. Uh, your. I'm from an anti Nori resistance group in Chief. I joined up with Yama there, came along when we heard about Circensia. Yama's talked my ears off about what happened to you as a kid. You sound like an idealistic brat to me. Why don't I bring, to the wor bring peace to the world? <laughs> There's nothing idealistic about ending this horrible war. <laughs> well, you got good eyes at least. I like Yama's. Eyes that can't lie. Sure, why not? I'll follow you. Hey. What, Scarlet? You got something to say? Ryama, he's your kid brother, right? I mean, I can see that reason. That's reason enough to trust him. Thank you. Wait, <laughs> if she was part of Noor, she'd be British. Yeah, she abandoned her for the accent. 
couldn't stand the British accent anymore, so I fucking... I, de I defected. Corrin. I don't think I can quite... Listen up. Listen up, Corrin. It's like this. Roma and I are going to head to Castle Shirasagi. Alexa, Roma, what's on the way on there? S Scarlet, that's enough. <laughs> we know who to ship him with. For a minute, I thought you meant soccer. I'm like, ew. <laughs> she came right up on the screen when you said that, dude. What's going on, Roma? Seems you're on your usual calm self when it comes to Scarlet. Oh, my. Ah, jeez. Just don't act so embarrassing in front of Hanukkah, all right? Just waiting for everyone back home. <laughs> Takumi, Sakura, take care of yourselves. Probably you won't die. We'll be our... Dude, Ryoma doesn't have a tight-ass sphincter. He can yes. tell what's going on. I promise. Um, um Ryoma, before you go... He can tell what's going on. I have something I'd like to ask you. When we spoke to Archduke Gizana, he told us to go meet the dragon. Do you know what he might have meant? Anything will help. Legends or otherwise. What? What? A dragon? So I don't know anything about dragons. I'll just ask the Rainbow Sage and Notre Sagace. Oh, that's a wonderful idea. The Rainbow Sage is said to be very wise. I'm starting to get used to her voice now. However, I've heard he is very, very picky about who he meets with. He likes the gay ones. Last time I waited in a line for like five hours. It was really inconvenient. And he let all the dudes fa pass. I thought he was sexist. No, he's just gay. It would turn out he's really... Really super gay. You do realize I'm going to have to voice him with the gayest voice ever now, right? Yes, and I want you to. That's why I did it. <laughs> Fat bitches! <laughs> <laughs> Just do the... Do, powerful people are given an audience. Do the fucking hand movements and everything. <sighs> really? Really? Yes. Gay sage, so... gay sage! <laughs> So I'm like by chat, but I can do like a gay voice really well because I've had gay friends. Nice. And it, and I love it. First, oh, it's you. The first was the former king of Hoshido, King Samaragi. And holy shit, do I have to piss? I'll be right back. Oh, get some soda. I'll be right back. The third was a knight whose name isn't known to anyone. Ah. Oh. And lastly, Xander. It's where he got that really bad cough. Xander with the Rainbow Sage? So he might actually know something and just refusing to tell us. Hmm. I'm sure, but he didn't outright deny it. Knowing anything. Oh, I'm sure, but he didn't outright deny knowing anything earlier. Yeah. No, today That was worked for her like a really smart Brit. Uh, <laughs> we need as much information as we can get. Let's go pay a page. Let's go pay the sage a visit. I think we can do one more chapter. Nah, I'm kind of tired. You already know. I was like oh. acting kind of weird earlier. Remind me, though, that that character's gay or I'll forget. I'll try to remember. We're clean here. Let me sprinkle some dust around for you. I just almost spit out what I was eating. Are you fucking kidding me right now? <laughs> this is so... <sighs> of course we can. Ain't no way they let you sit... They... they... Was this... Was Corrin really just... Wait, what? That honestly could be why they took out the face touching. Oh, because of gay things. I almost just spit out my peanut butter pretzels. I'm like, no fucking way. <laughs> Oh. People are worried about Sesame Street turning your kids gay. Oh! Oh, shit! Oh! You just spied on a 12-year-old in the bath. Ah, oh, Christ. Uh, that's getting cut out. I tend to act really high when I get sleepy. So what I'm going to do is that we're going to stream here. We're gonna, And tomorrow, I'm going to be joining this man on his stream. Where are you going to be streaming tomorrow? And I'm going to turn it on YouTube. Which one? What? 
Where are you gonna be streaming tomorrow? Uh, either that detective game or Pokemon Platinum. I'll figure it out. Uh, Depends what I feel like playing. Well, honestly. go subscribe to this man. It's Japan Lover Seventy Nine. Go follow him on YouTube. Really appreciate it because I want to help this man. I want to give him some pity subs. <laughs> hey! <laughs> All right. As and essentially for those that are new, please subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, that'll be really great. As for those watching after the stream, please subscribe if you think I'm worth it for your time and like the stream if you in case you found it entertaining. And leave a comment for any nice things you want to say about me. So um or about JP. So um yeah. Good night guys. I need to edit a video. Bye bye. By the way, I read all your comments, so be nice.